I've, I've lived here for about 30 years on Ocracoke and have had um, only one option for internet. And that's been inconsistent with the service and the billing and lots of troubles. Um, doing something like we have a um, spelling bee and I was watching the spell spelling bee as a parent on the Zoom and I could watch Essie and she was, the internet was so poor that I had to come home and get her and bring her back to my office so that she could participate in the spelling bee. This was prior to having Starlink. So, you know, it's, it makes a humongous difference <laughs> to have a great connection. Now, have you had any issues with Starlink or, or has it seemed to be, you know, smooth sailing? You know, at first we had some um, moments that it would lapse in, in connection, but okay. as the, as more satellites go up, <laughs> that the service gets better and better. Yeah, it's, it used to be kind of spotty at the beginning, but now it's really well and um, we can zoom at the same time, which is great. Mm -hmm. And how has school been in the past year? Do you feel more comfortable with catching up with school? Since the internet, I know a lot of, I think it's easier because a lot of, like there used to be problems with uh, people's internet so they couldn't get work done. But um, now that some, um, some people are getting Starlink, their internet is getting much better and it's um, allowing them to do more work. What do you wanna be when you grow up? Um, an author. <laughs> really? That's interesting, okay. I was gonna say, I would like Essie to tell you what she does with her friends. When she's hanging out with her friends on a Zoom, they are working on what? We're, um, we um, usually write when we're on Zoom. Um, they're writing a novel together and they're up to how many pages? 53. Mm -hmm. You can definitely see the difference between before we got Starlink and after we got Starlink.